Also in the works is Jake's dagger in the stomach. Jake will have to put this on under his costume for the second act. He has no time once he's out that door to get stabbed. Uh, it's just elastic band, plenty of snaps for adjustable. Wear it underneath his costume. There should be a hole in his shirt. Then the dagger will be on this. When he goes off stage, he will just place this and it will have that in his gut. And that should stay nice and sturdy. Yet another item that Jake will have to have under his costume for Act 2 is his blood pack if you decide to use that. This will be underneath. I usually put a little teeny bit of clay flat on the top so that water won't leak out if you fill this bag with a lot. When he comes off stage after being stabbed, that goes on very easy. What he will need help with, probably from a crew member, is to take this Velcro and put it around the dagger. Quick as that. So when he comes out, Jake is the one that controls this bladder and I didn't put enough water in there. There you go. So he can squirt the audience. If that's full, it'll give a nice squirt from the dagger sight. And these two items are in addition to the magnetic hand that grabs Annie's butt, only to be concealed somewhere 